Hi everybody, happy Halloween. This is Konstantin Reinfeldt and this is part 8 of my daily harmonica inspiration video series. Today I'll present to you a Montuno that I played in the intro of my first album called Mr. Kilento. It's part of the song Seven Orange and I played it on my C harmonica. So, the whole thing is in the key of D minor and in fact we are also starting out on a D here. A Montuno is a Cuban rhythm that is often played by a piano. It's very syncopated um, and I'm sure you know it. Um, this is a Montuno. <laughs> that Montuno already is in the key of D minor but I took it a little further and added two chords. So, the one I just played was already in the key of D minor, um, but this is what I played on the record. So I'm starting out with a D minor triad. I'm starting out with a D as a single note that's four whole draw on our C harmonica. After that I'm playing the double stop, 5 hole draw and 6 hole draw, that's the F and the A at the same time. So that's the first chord. Um, the next chord is C major. Again, it's just a triad. Um, so I'm playing C first, that's 4 hole blow. And then I'm adding the E and the G. Playing the double stop. That's 5-hole blow and 6-hole blow at the same time. So we have... The next chord is a B-flat major triad. So we gotta play that half-tone bend on 3. That's a little tricky. If we're adding the D and the F, we get the whole triad. So that's 4-hole draw and 5-hole draw. And then I had to think, because I um, wanted to go to the dominant chord of D minor, which is A7. Um, so I'm starting out on the A, which is the whole tone bend on 3. To get the A major triad, we need the C sharp and the E. Um, C sharp is four hole draw, half tone bend, and E is five hole blow. So we can't play that at the same time. So um, I just waste that fifth, which is not an uncommon thing in jazz music or in any style of music um, on the dominant chord. So instead of playing the E, I'm playing the F. That's five hole draw. And we can kind of play four hole half tone band, that's the C sharp, and F five hole draw at the same time. So just for itself it doesn't sound that good, but in context it works fine. So that's the whole thing slow. Before getting back to the first part of the loop, I'm playing 4 hole draw again. So that's the original tempo and that's the introduction of the tune. The B part is based on a similar thing, but I don't play the Montuna there. It's this. So 
something for you to figure out. Um, I hope you enjoyed this little lesson. Um, I look forward to seeing you in video episode number nine. And hope you have a great time. Bye.